I learned about the mental health challenges that our first responders face every day, being witness to multiple tragedies and the effect that this has on their families and loved ones. Everyone today highlighting how vital the passage of this bill is to protect the people who put their lives on the line for us every day. The HERO Act would direct the Secretary of Health and Human Services to find solutions for mental health issues amongst public safety officers. The cumulative effects of calls of service takes an unimaginable toll on our first responders. And we are only now just beginning to truly delve into what is happening and what can be done. Representative Ami Berra is one of the main sponsors of the bipartisan bill. More firefighters die of suicide than die in the line of duty. The bill would create a data system on first responder suicide rates to gather a clearer understanding of the contributing circumstances, offer peer support programs, and educate mental health professionals on treating first responder personnel. One child is trapped in a house, I've got one child trapped in a car. Chief House says first responders have finally begun to turn a corner around the stigma behind discussing mental health. We were probably um, maybe embarrassed to talk about it in, in previous years, you know. He's also advocating for this bill for those he's lost. I've not only lost people in the fire service, in the military, I've lost really close friends, kids, because of their trauma that they brought home. The chief hopes that if the bill passes, it will ensure the next generation of first responders won't have to deal with the stigma that he did. And Representative Barra says we owe it to those who risk their lives for us. And these are heroes that keep us safe every day, and we ought to do the same thing and make sure we're giving them the resources to keep them safe. The act has passed the House of Representatives three times and is awaiting approval from the Senate. The fire chief says the most important thing that first responders with PTSD can do is talk about it. Everyone today does ultimately believe that the bill will pass. In Sacramento, reporting local news that matters, I'm Juliette Smith, Fox 40 News.